Students being drugged with laced brownies. These are the shocking allegations being made tonight against the former head of schools at the Army Navy Academy in Carlsbad. Prosecutors now say Jeffrey Barton's sexual abuse against seven victims spanned three decades and three schools. 10 News reporter Vanessa Van Hefty has the deal that may have allowed him to keep getting hired. Prosecutors say Jeffrey Barton, the former head of the Army and Navy Academy in Carlsbad, gave his victims drug-laced homemade brownies that caused them to black out. The defendant would have homemade baked goods, brownies, and insist that these boys eat them. There were rumors around the school, don't eat the brownies, they're laced with something. Seven victims have come forward. Pryor says four are from Barton's previous employer at McCallie Boarding School for Boys in Tennessee, where he was allegedly fired for fondling boys. A settlement prevented the school from ever discussing the case. Another victim says Barton molested him here at Aiken Preparatory Boarding School for Boys in South Carolina. And prosecutors say two are from the Army and Navy Academy, where the abuse happened here at Barton's on-campus home, in his office, his car, and in hotels on out-of-town trips. In all, Barton faces 16 felony counts. In this 2010 deposition obtained only by 10 News, Barton denied sexual misconduct. Were you ever accused of engaging any type of uh, inappropriate sexual activity with kids? Never? Barton's attorney says the case is nothing more than a shakedown on the school, arguing that there hadn't been any alleged victims since 2001. In Vista, Vanessa Van Hefty, 10 News. The victims say the abuse happened when they were 14 and 15 years old. The judge set bail at $3 million, calling Barton an extreme danger to the community.